So you want to learn the MVVM pattern, but you don't have a lot of time? In just a few minutes, we'll go over everything you need to know to understand how this pattern works. Let's start with this view controller. If you think about it, this view controller actually has a lot of responsibilities. It must fetch its data, format its data, and then finally display its data. And with so many responsibilities, this view controller will become harder and harder to maintain as our app will grow in complexity. That's why it makes sense to extract some of these responsibilities to another object called a view model. So let's do it in six easy steps. Step one, we create the view model. Step two, we extract the service and the formatter to the view model. Step three, we add a callback to update the UI whenever the data gets updated. Step four, we move the logic to fetch and format the data to the view model. Step five, we provide the view controller with an instance of the view model. And finally, step six, the view controller can now rely on the view model to fetch and format the data. And that's it, we've successfully implemented the MVVM pattern in Swift.